For many families, it's not the 4th of July without fireworks. But for combat veteran Chris Tortolot, those same fireworks are a quick passport back to Vietnam. When I got out in 1970, I figured that this stuff would go away. But, you know, 46 years later, it still bothers me. The whistling, booming, and rapid speed of fireworks are all triggers for what Chris calls a constant nightmare from the time they go off until he wakes up the next day. Well, you're instantly put back in Vietnam, you know, and if it's like, especially in the evenings, you know, because that's when the BC always, you know, threw the rockets and the mortars and all that stuff at you. Chris says the anxiety starts days before the celebrations do. He avoids fireworks entirely to prevent nightmares and flashbacks, but says veterans need courteous neighbors this time of year who will warn them ahead of the warfare-like noise. Well, maybe my neighbor, I, and you know, you pretty much know, oh, he, he's a veteran. I might want to go over and tell him around 9 o'clock we're going to be shooting off some fireworks. You might want to go in your bedroom and shut the door. And though it helps, he says it's still a misery he can't escape from, and one many people don't think about while watching the sky light up.